Welcome to this course on modeling and digital implementation of power electronic uh, converters for renewable energy applications. This course focuses on the fundamental concepts of modeling, the design and the control schemes for power electronic interfaces like DC to DC converters, DC to AC inverters and AC to DC PWM controlled rectifiers for electric vehicle and renewable applications. Power electronics has a key role to play in various applications like lighting, welding, industrial automation, renewables and electric vehicles. Among them, the renewable energy applications and the electric vehicles dominate. Digital controllers have been popularly used in implementing the control, monitoring and the protection in the power electronic systems which has been designed for the various applications. This is due to the benefits what we get from the digital control like flexibility, configurability, reliability and repeatability. To have an understanding of digital control implementations in various power electronic interfaces, we have considered a system throughout in this course a solar PV battery integrated power electronic interface for grid tied applications. This system comprises of DC to DC power interface units fed from battery and solar PV. To this together forms the 800 volts DC bus for the inverter and the DC to AC inverter is feeding the grid and the local loads. So, this course is further divided into four sub modules. In the module 1 we shall see DC to DC converter modeling and control. So, in this module we shall see a solar PV fed non isolated boost converter modeling control and design followed by a battery fed high gain resonant converter. So, this boost converter and the resonant converter together forms the DC bus of 800 volts for the inverter. In the module 2, we shall see the modeling and control for the grid tied DC to AC inverter, modeling and control for inverter feeding the standalone loads. In module 3, the DC to AC inverter, modeling and control to function as a power factor correction converter for battery charging applications is covered. And in the module 4, the complete system operation, the power quality aspects, the concepts of eye landing uh, operation, the power management schemes shall be covered. So, the complete system model and the control are implemented by elemental real time simulations in Texas DSP. F2I379D C2000 Delfino launch pad. The modeling and control for the system considered is implemented by using the elemental real time simulation concept in the F2I379D. To verify the control implementations of the system, the plant and the controller together are modeled using integral differential equations in DSP. This is one of the key aspect of this course. So, the peripheral modules used for uh, programming F2I379D are the general purpose IO, the timer module, the enhanced PWM module and the data acquisition modules of F2I379D. So, the architecture of the DSP and the programming of the peripheral modules, the configurations are covered in the first part of the course which is digital control for our applications. Hope we have a great learning in this course and see you there. Thank you.